Have you ever heard of a ghost ship sailing the seas with no crew aboard? Today, we're delving into the enigmatic tale of the Mary Celeste, a ship discovered adrift in the vast expanse of the Atlantic Ocean back in 1872. But what made this discovery so peculiar? Well, there was no sign of its crew. The Mary Celeste was found in a perfectly seaworthy condition. The ship's provisions enough to last for six months were untouched. The crew's personal belongings were still in place just as if they had stepped out for a moment and would soon return. The ship's logbook however ended abruptly a few days before the ship was found. It was as if the crew had simply evaporated into the thin sea air. Despite the ship being discovered in good condition and the ample food and water supply, the crew was nowhere to be found. The crew had vanished without a trace, leaving behind a mystery that has baffled investigators for over a century. The story of the Mary Celeste begins with its departure from New York on November 7, 1872. A brisk autumn day, the air filled with anticipation and a dash of the unknown. At the helm was Captain Benjamin Briggs, a seasoned mariner, a man of unrivaled courage and conviction. He was accompanied by his wife Sarah, and their two-year-old daughter Sophia. The rest of the crew, a seasoned bunch of seven, were also on board, each carrying his own dreams and fears. The Mary Celeste was not just carrying her passengers across the Atlantic that day, she was also laden with a substantial cargo. Precisely, she was transporting 1,700 barrels of industrial alcohol, all slated for delivery in Genoa, Italy. This cargo, while not inherently dangerous, could prove volatile under the right circumstances, a fact that would later feed the mystery surrounding this fateful voyage. As the days passed, the ship's log painted a picture of an uneventful journey, November 25th was the date of the last entry, penned by Captain Briggs himself. The words were mundane, detailing weather conditions and the ship's coordinates. There was no indication of any trouble, no hint of the calamity to come. Estimations based on the log suggest that the ship might have been abandoned shortly after that last entry, perhaps within the next few days. But why would a seasoned captain and his crew abandon a perfectly seaworthy ship? And why leave behind a cargo worth a small fortune? These questions hung in the air as heavy and impenetrable as the fog that often shrouds the sea. The Mary Celeste was found adrift on December 4th, just under a month after its departure, with no soul aboard. A ghost ship, bobbing aimlessly on the Atlantic waves, her crew and passengers vanished, as if whisked away by the sea itself. The mystery of the Mary Celeste had begun, a tale that would echo through the ages, forever shrouded in a cloak of enigma and conjecture. Over the years many theories have been proposed to explain the Mary Celeste mystery. One of the most talked about theories is mutiny. The idea that the crew, for reasons unknown, rose up against Captain Briggs and his family, and subsequently disappeared. But this theory stumbles when considering the ship's good condition, and the fact that everyone's personal belongings were left untouched. If there was a violent mutiny, wouldn't we expect more signs of struggle on the ship? Another theory suggests a seaquake might have frightened the crew into abandoning ship. As plausible as it sounds, this theory also has its flaws. The ship's log revealed no mention of a seaquake, and the ship itself was found in a relatively undisturbed state, which contradicts the expected aftermath of such an event. A water spout or a tornado at sea is another possible explanation. This could have filled the ship with water, prompting the crew to abandon ship. However, the ship was found with only a meter of water in the bilge, an amount that could be considered normal for a ship of its size. Some speculate that the nine barrels of alcohol found empty in the ship's hold might have leaked, creating a dangerous buildup of alcohol fumes. Fearing an imminent explosion, the crew might have abandoned ship, but an investigation found no signs of an explosion or fire on board. And then there are the more outlandish theories, alien abduction anyone? As amusing as it sounds, this theory lacks any substantial evidence and is largely dismissed by serious researchers. Despite the multitude of theories, the mystery of what happened to the crew of the Mary Celeste remains unsolved. Each theory has its merits and its flaws, and without definitive proof, we are left with speculation. The fate of the crew is a riddle that perhaps will never be solved, a testament to the unpredictable and unforgiving nature of the sea. The Mary Celeste wasn't just a ship, she became a symbol of one of the greatest maritime mysteries of all time. This enigmatic vessel didn't just vanish into the annals of history, she sailed straight into the heart of popular culture, leaving a wake of fascination and intrigue in her path. The tale of the Mary Celeste has been recounted in countless books, immortalizing the ship and her lost crew in the realm of literature. 
From Arthur Conan Doyle's early interpretation in J. Habakkuk Jeffson's statement to Brian Fremantle's modern-day thriller The Mary Celeste, authors have been captivated by the ship's story. The Mary Celeste has also anchored herself in the world of film and television. She's been depicted in everything from classic cinema like The Mystery of the Mary Celeste to episodes of popular TV series like Voyage to the Bottom of the Sea and Doctor Who. Each screen adaptation offers a unique take on the mystery, allowing the Mary Celeste to sail across generations, captivating audiences of all ages. And yet, despite the many interpretations and speculations, the true story of the Mary Celeste remains hidden beneath the waves of time. This ongoing enigma continues to spark curiosity, inspiring new theories and investigations. Amateur sleuths and professional historians alike are drawn to the mystery, each hoping to uncover the truth behind the ghost ship. The legacy of the Mary Celeste is not just in the pages of books or the frames of films, but in the endless pursuit of understanding. She stands as a testament to the human desire to explore the unknown, to solve the unsolvable, to venture into the uncharted waters of mystery. The Mary Celeste will forever sail in our minds as a ghost ship, a reminder of the sea's enduring mystery and the human fascination with the unexplained. Uh -huh.